guys, my name is Vanessa. I've been a nurse for six years, and today I wanted to take some time to do a nursing review. And we're going to start with fluid and electrolyte, hypervolemia. So fluid and electrolyte, hypervolemia. Fluid, fluid and electrolyte is very broad, and it contains a lot, but we're not going to have time to do all of that in one video. So I'm going to break it down, each subject for each video. So this video is going to be about hypervolemia. Mon ki pa kopon mo yo, mba telman ka translate tout bagay, men ma translate as much as I can. Non mwen si Vanessa, mwen son infimye pou 6 an, en jodi amble pontan pou mpale de nursing. So, de nursing mwen pale de fluid and electrolyte, hypervolemia. Ok? Hypervolemia, ki sa ki hypervolemia? Is when you have too much fluid in your vascular space. Ki sa ki vascular space? It could be your arteries, it could be your veins, and also the chambers of your heart. When that has too much fluid, ou vin gen hypervolemia. Lò gen trop, fluid nan vein ou nan artery ou ou gen hypervolemia. Ki sa ki ka bo hypervolemia? One of the things I can give you hypervolemia is congestive heart failure. Paske lo gen congestive heart failure, which is CHF, li fe ke ou feb. So ke ou pa bat as much as it's... So ke ou pa bat as much as it should. So that means you're gonna have low cardiac output, low kidney perfusion. So le kidney ou pa perfuse, you're not really putting much pee out. You're not really gonna pee ou pa pipi wap retain an pil fluid nan vascular space ou, which means you're gonna have hypervolemia. Ok? So, CHF, fe ou gen hypervolemia, paske ke ou feb, ke ou pa ka travay, kidni ou pa perfuse, le kidni ou pa perfuse, tout pipi, tout lo ta supose jete, tout rete nan vascular space ou, fe ou gen hypervolemia. Sa se yun ki ka bo hypervolemia. Dezem baka ki ka bo hypervolemia, se kidni failure. Le kidni failure, Log e kidney failure, kidney ou pa travay. So le kidney ou pa travay, ou pa pipi, everything, whether it's electrolytes, whether it's fluid, is gonna be backed up on your vascular space. Meaning, li pal bo hypervolemia. Sa se dezem bagay ki ka bo hypervolemia. Toazem bagay ki ka bo hypervolemia, se on bagay ki yo le aldasterone. Aldasterone se on steroid ki get released by the adrenal gland, which is on top of your kidney. So kidney ou, sou tet kidney ou, ou gen on gland ki rele adrenal gland. Adrenal gland nan, li relis sa rele steroid. Steroid li relis la, yun nan steroid li relis rele aldesterone. Aldesterone li relis nan, sa li fe. Li fe kon ou ken be ni sel, ni dlo. It makes you retain water and sodium. So aldesterone make you retain water and sodium. Pa jan blie, se tou le de li fo ken be. Li fo ken be ni sel, ni dlo. Ok? So, lò gen an maladi ki rele hyperaldasteronism, da men kò fè trop aldasteron. Se de bagay ki ka fò fè aldasteron trop, sa rele hyperaldasteronism avèk Cushing syndrome. Se de bagay sa ou. So, de pou e maladi sa ou ap gen tan konè ke, yon nan size and symptoms yo se hypervolimia la pie, la pie gen edema. Ok? Pa blie. Aldasteron ka fò gen hypervolimia, paske li fò ken be ni sodium, ni fluid. Lò kembe ni sodium ni fluid, everything is gonna get backed up in your vascular space. So, depi vascular space ou gen twop fluid, sa yele hypervolemia. Katri yon baga ki kabo hypervolemia, se ADH. ADH son hormon ko ou fe. On son hormon ko ou fe. ADH is a hormon that your body release. When it get release, it tells your body to retain water. Son hormon ko ou fe ko ou ka podwi, lel podwi li fo kembe dlo, li pa fo kembe sel, mem sa kaldasteron nan, li fo kembe dlo selman. So mem jon konen lo gen hormon, ou ka fe trop, ou gen ka fe trop iti. So gen maladi ki ka fo fe trop ADH, sa re le SIDH, ok? SIDH. Re le SIDH, which means Syndrome of Inappropriate Antidiuretic Hormon. So lo re le sli trop, kon fò fèl trop, so lò fè trop ADH, nou konè ADH sa fèl fò kembe dlo, li fò kembe fluid, ki kote l fò kembe fluid la en yon vascular space. So depi mwen mwen gon SIDH, wap gen tan konè ke mwen zap gen an pil edima. Depi mwen nan gen SIDH, wap gen edima, because tout fluid yo pa l back up nan vascular space li, en le vascular space ou plen, li pa l nan tissue, so konè mwen zap gen edima. So SIDH ka bo, Hypervolemia, paske ou fè trop ADH, ADH sa l fè, li fò kèm be dlo nan vascular space sou. Sa se ou katriye mare ki ka fò gen hypervolemia. Fou la nou pal pale de signs and symptoms. Ki sa ki ka moutè yon moun gen hypervolemia? What are the signs of symptoms of hypervolemia? One of the signs and symptoms 
is extended neck vein. So basically, what we vein mon qui là, li distended, li gros parce que tout fluid yo gen a gros nan vein nan de neck vein ou gen la la vein gros parce que get trop fluid en dan vein too. So that's one of the signs and symptoms that you're gonna see a patient have. You're gonna see that they have a distended neck vein. Okay, that's one. Two, you're gonna have edema. As I mentioned plenty of time, edema ki sa ki edema. Edema se lè kom ou nan gwo, men li an fle, ou bien pie li an fle, lò pe ze men li, ok? Li ken be fom nan, li pa retoune bak nan nan mal fom ni pou an bon titan, ok? Di rete li tou fon tou, lò pe ze pie moun nan, ou bien do pie moun nan, ou bien do men moun nan, li fon tou, li pou an pil kat ou retoune bak nan nan mal, sou vle, sa ve di moun nan gen edema. So sa e se yun nan signs and symptoms, ki montre ke moun nan gen hypervolimia. Ok? Edema. Troisième bagay, se lo akoute lungs moun nan. When you hear the lung sounds, you're gonna hear a wet sound or crackles. It's gonna sound very wet. Se tako bagay ki mouye. Ok? En wap tan de crackles nan ven moun nan. So, de boutan de crackles, ou gen takone ke, that could be edema or that could be hypervolemia because that's one of the things. Lo gen fluid nan lungs ou, this sounds crackles. Lo gen et 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 de l'eau na poumon ou ap tande crackle sound because it's wet OK so troisième c'est lung sounds sa blood pressure a pi blood pressure a monter because ke ou ap travay trop pou retirer tout de l'eau sa ou ki nan vascular space ou pouls ou ap monter you gonna have a bounding pulse that bounding pulse when you check it um lo check it pulse mon nan ou après son bounding pulse li sa bounding c'est que son son rivière qui descend c'est que son force on de l'eau qui vient avec un force kap mache nan ven nou because di gan pil fluid so la gen plus force se sa so keyword bounding de boutan de moun nan gen bounding bounding pulse ou ap geta konen gan pil fluid nan ven moun nan and last but not least weight gain moun nan gen nan pil weight moun nan overnight lap gen pwa moun nan ka dom ya 121 liv li leve ya a 125 so sa vle di gon chanj ki fe so tout fluid yo ale nan tishu yo make you heavier okay so basically overnight weight gain um out of the ordinary weight gain is one of the signs of symptoms of edema okay treatment treatment how do you treat hypervolemia basically what teach patient pour manger low sodium diet you're gonna teach your patient to follow a low sodium diet and also doctor a caprice okay ou pa um teach patient ou pa eduke patient pou pa manje trop sel okay you gonna teach your patient to eat a low sodium diet and also doctor a ka prescrit diuretic diuretic la fo pipi diuretic is gonna make you pee gen gen plus de qualité de type diuretic which i'm gonna make another video ma fon lot video pou m pale de pharmacologie ma bon plus explication ki sa ki diuretic pou ka konprann kòman diuretic travay nan ko men pou konn ya Kom se hypervolimia na pale selman, na fokus, na fokus sou hypervolimia. Let me know if you have a subject that you need help with. Fem konen sou gon suje ki ou ta ame gen plus explikasyon sou li, ki te komen tou bien vre mesaj pou mwen. Follow me, subscribe, like, and share. Thank you.